Hey guys, it's Sandy, and in today's nail art tutorial, I'm going to be showing you 10 different super easy nail art designs that are perfect for beginners to nail art. If you like these ultimate guide videos, then hit that like button down below. Don't forget to subscribe so you never miss a nail tutorial, and let me know down in the comments which of these 10 designs is your favorite. And now let's get started. The first nail art design is a 3D line design that looks really cool and is super easy to do. Begin by painting your nail black. Next, add a big stroke of dark purple down your nail. You may need two coats here for best opacity as we're placing it over black. Once that's done, go in with a lighter purple and add a stroke. And finally, use a white polish to add the final stripe down the middle. I did this on my little pinky nail, so I opted to use a white striper as it's a little smaller than a regular nail polish brush. All done! The next nail art design is an interlocked dot cure that looks really intricate, but it's super easy to do. For this design, I began by painting my nails with two coats of a bright blue nail polish. Once that dried, I added a chrome silver nail polish diagonally across the nail and filled in one side. Next, use a big dotting tool to add some dots over the blue side right where it meets the silver. Then add a couple smaller silver dots over the blue side. I like to line these up with the spaces between the big dots so it looks really neat and tidy. Then add big blue dots on the silver side in between the big silver dots. This is the reverse of what we did before. See how it easily makes these cool interlocking dots? Add in some small blue dots over the silver side to complete the nail art design. Finish off all of these designs here today with a fast drying top coat. The third nail art design is perfect if you'd like to quickly add some flowers over your nail, but you don't have any nail tools whatsoever. Begin with a white base color. Once that's dry, add three yellow dots as guidelines to help you place the flowers. Then use different colors of nail polish to add little strokes around the yellow dots to create some petals. There's no need to worry about the petals being perfect. This is more of a watercolor flower look, so don't overthink it, just do it. Then you can add in some random petals in open white areas. And finally, go back in with the yellow to create perfect centers in the middle of the flowers. Top coat to finish! The next nail art design is a really cool braided look. You're going to need three different nail polish colors for this one, and essentially all you do is go through all three of those colors and stroke the brush from left to right and right to left over and over again. I set up my camera differently than I normally do for these nail tutorials, so I only realized during editing that you couldn't see the brush very well when it went from the left to the right on the screen. So if you'd like to see a more in-depth look at this tutorial, then you can click the info card and check out a tutorial I did ages ago on this specific look. The fifth nail art design is a super easy, classic galaxy design. This is one of my all-time favorites because first off, I love space, but secondly, it looks so awesome and it's surprisingly so quick and simple to do. Begin by painting your nail black and then use a little piece of makeup sponge and tweezers to create white nebulas over your nail. Then add in a bright blue over the white. Add in a dark blue where the black meets the bright blue to blend it together. Finally, add a nail polish that has little black and white circle confetti in it for the stars. So easy and looks really cool. You can add different colors into the nebula too, like purple, pink, or yellow. Next up is another classic and super easy design, Leopard Spot Nail Art. I'm starting off with a white base and then I'm adding a couple different colored big spots over the nail just using the nail polish brush. Don't add too many because you need to save room for small black spots at the end. Using a toothpick, go in with some black nail polish and add C shapes and little dots around each of the big colored spots. This is another design where you don't need to overthink it, just do it. Then add in little black spots in open white areas. Make sure they're not all perfectly round spots. It looks more realistic this way. The seventh nail art design is a fizzy bubble gradient. Start with a light base color. I chose purple. Then add in a few big spots in a darker purple color to the bottom of the nail. Then as you go up the nail, add in a few smaller ones. 
Finally, use an even darker purple and overlap some big spots at the bottom of the nail and again some smaller ones as you move upwards. Remember that you can just choose one design from this guide to use if you'd like and match it up with some complementary colored nails for your manicure. The eighth design is a super easy waterfall design using stripers. Begin with a white base color. Then using a few different shades of pink plus a sparkly silver, add in some lines coming down from the cuticle. A cute and quick design that's really easy to do. This scallop nail art design is one of my favorites because it's really pretty and you can use any colors you'd like. Plus, it's super fast and easy to do. I started with a light base and then chose a Tiffany blue and started in the middle of the nail and did three strokes down the nail at varying heights to create three bumps. Then I used red and I did the same pattern to create three more scallops. Really cute, I love this one. Finish off with a top coat to seal it all in. And if all else fails, you can always just paint my polar bear in a snowstorm design. I hope you guys enjoyed this ultimate guide to easy nail art. If you'd like to see more nail art tutorials here on Cute Polish, then click the button in the top right corner. Thanks for watching, take care, and I'll see you next time!